All right, so who am I here with? Ah, uh -huh, what's up, broke assholes? It's me, Lord Len. Uh, who wanna smoke? I'ma give it out like it's some candy. Why you say ah? Ah? Yeah. Ah. Now why you got like this Joker type outfit? Like you look like Harley Quinn right now. Joker? Do I look like I tell jokes? Oh, you right now you kind of do. Okay. Ah, it's me, Lord Len. Okay. You like Harley Quinn? Harley Quinn? Yeah. No, I got beef with that bitch. It's up in the stuck. I don't care. You can tell her send a low too. I'm in New York. What's good? Big Apple. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you don't like her. So what's the inspiration behind this? This? Yeah. My dad. Your dad? Yeah. What, 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 your dad was like a clown or something? Yes. For real? Yes. He was a clown. Like he, like he would go to parties yeah, and like... No, no. He owned the circus and he was the ringmaster. The butt. <laughs> he owned a circus like... Uh, What's that, Raybelines? Ray, what's that called? You know what I'm talking about? No, and whoever that is, I got beef for them too. It's up in his thug. It's Fuck like the Raybelines. Well, I don't even know what they call. But so he used to have like animals and shit, like perform and shit. Like, yeah. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Okay. So how was it like, you know, growing up in Florida? Cause I see you from Florida. Really nice. Really nice. Really nice. Yeah. I'm assuming you was on the road a lot because, like, you know, your dad was in a circus and stuff? Yes. I was. So, what made you want to do music and not become a circus act? These nuts! Ha! <laughs> Got he! <laughs> Got he! Ha ha ha! Aha, it's Miller Len. Aha, it's Miller Len. Why is it like giving like NPC vibes? Oh, is this supposed to be a real interview right now? Yeah, I'm asking you questions. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh shit, what made me want to start music? I wanted to talk shit about these broke ass, bum ass, ugly ass bitches. Period. Why you got beef with, why, why you got beef with broke people? Like. Beef with broke people? How do I have beef with broke people? You said, you, you said beef with these broke ass bitches. Yeah, I don't like these bitches, bro. I feel like it was time for somebody to talk that real shit and at the end of the day, aha, it's me, Lord Len. So speaking of broke ass bitches, is no motion, is slow motion better than no motion? Yes, I agree. I do agree. I do agree. Slow and steady wins the pace. Rome wasn't built in a day. Hey, let me tell you, it takes a lot to build an empire. So slow motion is better than no motion. That's a very great quote. I'm glad you said that. Of course, this come on, cause you got beef for broke ass hoes. What about hoes that got slow motion? Okay, so. I know you heard this a lot, you know what I'm saying? I just have to ask, I'm pretty sure the people wanna know. I know you get a lot of the murder beat conspiracies. Was she like a like somewhat of inspiration into your music maybe? Cause like, you know, she started the whole yelling shit and like now you like kinda yelling in your songs and like drill rap way type shit. Oh, this is a real interview. I'm so sorry, friends. I really thought this was some like, this was, I, I really thought this was some, all right, so bomb, like, I get compared to a lot of people, bro. And a lot of people want to say I sound like this or I sound like that. At the end of the day, I'm Lord Len, bro. I'm hard as fuck. I've been talking my shit. I've been doing this. I've been doing that. Just because I turned up the volume, I feel like now people are hearing me. And I don't know. I don't know. You can compare me to people if you want. Who do, who, who do, who do they mostly compare you to? Six, nine. Uh... I see 6 9 female 6 9 female Mabu, F female Mabu. Mabu, you mean? Sure, yeah, Mabu. Uh, I don't know. Mm, I see a lot of different names in there, though. So how is it making music in Florida? Because, you know, it's not very drill dominant, and the music that you're making is, like, drill. Um, it's lit making music in Florida that's has a drill sound to it because it sounds hard. I was born in New York, I grew up in Florida. I'm the ping pong from two states. I've been coming here my whole life. I'm 50-50, but if, if we gonna break it down. So at the end of the day, I brought it down there. I mixed it with Florida shit that I fuck with. If you listen to my music and you hear the terminology, I got some of this, some of that. So it's like Chex Mix, Trail Mix, bitch. You're not gonna get one thing. I'm not one flavor. You get what I'm saying? But I brought it to the South and I see bitches are biting. Arr, arr. <laughs> Ha ha ha!
Like who? Uh, boys, girls, theys, thems. You'll see soon, bro. It's down to the look. It's actually getting quite ridiculous. It's actually getting quite fucking funny. I actually love it. Down to the look, so people like dressing up as Joker. Bro, why are you? Yo, let me tell you something. They wanted to clown me, bro. For years they wanted to clown me. They wanted to laugh at me, make fun of me, bro, for real. And then look, I start clowning y'all right the fuck back. Right the fuck back. And now bitches wanna say, oh, this and third. Let me do this. Let me do that. I thought I wasn't cool though. So yeah, people be fucking biting, bro. Boys, girls, theys, thems, all the above, bitch. But I don't care. I'm the best. That's the, I, I get the little the little joke you said because you're clowning dumb and you're like a clown like that like you know. Aha! Uh -huh. You get the joke. Aha! Uh -huh, you get the joke. Definitely yeah. Definitely so um, were you listening to anybody like from the New York drill scene when you was like back in the day when you was like coming up? I I listened to a lot of like New York rappers and like like down south rappers. So I like listening to people from like. Atlanta and shit. I like listening to people from up here. I like listening to people from Florida. I like listening to everybody, bro. I'm a real artist. I listen to all types of music. You get what I'm saying? Would, you, would that mean you would switch up your music yeah. soon? I mean, not soon, but when I want to, when the time's right, we all go through eras. You feel me? So it's like, right now I'm raging and I'm, I'm going dumb. So wait for me to fizzle out and we'll see what happens. So you doing drill. What do you think about people saying that drill's dying? I don't, I don't know about that because I, I think it's thriving. If anything, I think it's going to keep going up, like, to be honest, because I see it transitioning from where I'm from. And as you said, this is a New York sound, and I live in Florida. You get what I'm saying? So it's like, that's not going to die. It's going to thrive. It's, it's, we have, I, I don't think we've seen it, its peak yet. You feel me? That's true. They, they, they're sexy drill now. I don't know if you know what that is. Yeah, I know. They've been snapping. They've been doing their big one. Would you ever maybe, like, fuck around with those type of beats? Yeah, I would. I, 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 would, I would get on anything that, that sounds lit. You get what I'm saying? I don't care what genre it is. Like, to an extent, you know, <laughs> I'm not gonna do no classical, you know, but at the same time, like, if it's hard, it's hard. So who, if you could collaborate with one female in the drill scene, who would that be? Female in the drill scene? Yeah. Mm. It doesn't have to be New York, it could be Chicago, it could be anywhere. There's a lot of good females out here. I don't know who I collab with. I can't pick one from the drill scene. I could pick a female artist, but I don't know if I can pick a, a female drill rapper. I don't know. The reason I say that is because you make drill music, it would just make sense, you know? Yeah, I don't know. There's a handful of them that are hard though. Whichever one, whichever one wanted, they can hit me up. Cause for the most part, I see you like make a solo tracks and shit. You know? Yeah, I, 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 I'm working by myself right now. I don't work good with people, but if I click with you and I fuck with you and I want to work with you, I'll work with you. And if you want to work with me, I don't chase nobody. You feel me? No, of course, 100. percent So, in all your videos, I was looking at the comments and. What do you think of the comments of people saying it's better on mute or yo you should stop rapping? And oh, I don't know. They helped me break the algorithm. I, I, I just hit three million on one of my little reels right now, and I was just saying to my little vlog like, thank you to everybody that commented on this shit. Thank you to everybody that talked shit about it because it's like y'all helped me break the algorithm. I just be my own personal record. So it's like okay, then bum like that's fine. You know, it's 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 funny. It's a meme. It's it's just what people say on the internet, bro. It's not real. That's just hard. You can't say much. It's not hard, bro. But yeah. Like, yeah, it's the internet. Fuck people's opinion the end of the day, you know what I mean? Yeah. Keep doing your thing, you're doing your thing, you feel me? Um, so, how did you get the name Lord Len? I came up with it myself. Um, I watched the Kardashians growing up, and one of their baby daddies bought a piece of land in a different country, and that made him a lord, like a king. And so I was like, oh my god, that's so cool, I'm gonna be Lord Len one day, and I'm Lord Len right now. Your name is like Lena? No, that's not my name. I'm just uh, trying to assume what the Len is. Mm -mm. That, nah, it's a part of my name, but I got a foreign name, so you're not gonna understand it. But yeah, you could look it up. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. So, what can people expect from you? Like, what can we expect next? Um, lots more content coming out, lots more visuals coming out, maybe some collabs coming out. Um, I don't know, and I'm definitely doing a little PR run right now, so I might come to a city near you. I don't know, but yeah, a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. Oh my god, so much list stuff, but I don't want to talk about it until it's done. What about like any songs, maybe any project you working on? I just dropped a mixtape, my first official mixtape I just dropped. It's called Lord Have Mercy. It's out right, right now on all streaming platforms. So go run that shit the fuck up. It's a banger. Every every song's a banger, front to back, 10 songs, new songs. And yeah, right now I'm just promoting the fuck out of that shit. I'm going dumb. And where the people can find you at, like all your social medias? You can find me on Instagram at TheLordLen. That's T-H-E-L-O-R-D-L-E-N. And then all my links are in my bio, period. And before we end this interview, anything that you want to tell the people? Oh, what's up, broke assholes? It's me, Lord Len. 
Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Love you. Well, love all my fans. Love all my supporters. You know the fucking vibes. So all my haters, I love you ten times more because y'all the ones that really help me break that shit for real. So, aha. Uh -huh. One more question. Mm -hmm. Do you want some cock? Oh! Do I want some what? Some, some cock. Some cock? Yeah. I know you're not asking me no dumbass question at the end of the interview, bro. I know you're not asking me no stupid ass question. I started this off thinking this was just gonna be a, a little TikTok and then we go in and we got it real and now you're gonna ask me some perverted ass shit like that? Nah, I'm just asking. Yo, wrap this shit up. We about to leave on yeah. some real shit. You about to leave? Yeah, we done. We done. I'm talking about. Man, get that dumb ass shit out of my face. I'm done. It's with a it. soup. It's a I'm soup. I'm done with it. Thank it, you.